Lionel Messi has lost his Ballon d'Or crown, of course, to Cristiano Ronaldo. And will be hoping to retain it when the glittering ceremony arrives again in Zurich in January. But this man, in the eyes of many, is currently unassailable at the top of the world game. But both he and Messi, the centrepieces of tonight's match. Ronaldo will fill up, obviously, in support. There's Messi. Messi again. Lovely little ball to Di Maria. And only just wide. For Mangel Di Maria. Set up from Messi. Just a little cute pass here from Messi. Into the stride of Di Maria. And the game's opening chance falling to Di Maria and Argentina. Otamendi. Di Michelis. Leo Messi. Looks to take on the debutant, Thiago Gomez. Bilia looks for Messi again. Flag stays down. Oh, and right across the face. It was such a, an acute angle. He just couldn't find the back of the net. But that little burst of acceleration from Lionel Messi, how often we've seen it onside. Pepe playing him on. May just have touched off the near post of the goalkeeper Beto will see it from this terrific angle yep just came off the post and he was close Di Maria here's Messi running at Thiago Gomez and Caglia arriving to his right another good run from the fullback and Pastore Beto equal to the Javier Pastore header, but again, Facundo Roncaglia doing well, the right back. Just seemed to slightly lose his feet there, Beto, but it was a relatively comfortable stop in the end. There's Jose Basingo, he's in behind Argentina here, excellent ball in, taking off the toe of Ronaldo, but he's there again, Ronaldo! And it's over. Well, he was twisting, turning, almost sending Bilia out of the ground. But couldn't hit the target. Bosingua in behind the left side of that Argentina defence. When Caglia did enough to hold Ronaldo up, he still got his shot away. And the first sight of goal for the prolific Cristiano Ronaldo. Argentina breathe a sigh of relief. His eyes with a little Coutinho. Ronaldo got there ahead of Ansaldi. Martin Atkinson's going to produce a yellow card here for Christian Ansaldi. Well, I don't really think the referee's got much more of an option here. It's Ronaldo towed the ball before Ansaldi could arrive. And uh, it's a clear foul, and the referee decides. Yeah. I think he does try to pull out of it, in fairness, looking at that uh, replay, and Saldi. Yeah, it just have been that R Ronaldo was engaging the contact, but the yellow card goes to Argentina's number three. Now Nani will be looking to place this just beyond the penalty spot. It's just about where Ronaldo is placed on the edge of the area but beyond that penalty spot and it's in there and no Portugal shirt can get on the end of it that was a decent free kick from Nani but no takers there's a certain amount of relief for Otamendi who thrust out a leg at fresh air Messi away from Andre Gomez Bruno Alves hesitating Pastore struck Messi back with Pastore and a free kick to Argentina challenge on Pastore and another yellow 
card this time for Moutinho. Well, if Ansaldi's getting one for what he produced at the other end, there's no doubt Moutinho was getting booked there. Well, a wonderful position here for Messi. It's just about the perfect angle for his left foot. Well, the goalkeeper will be facing Messi at the weekend in La Liga. Beto plays for Sevilla, who play Barcelona at the Camp Nou this coming weekend. I suspect the Portugal goalkeeper will be facing a few Messi free kicks in that league fixture at the weekend. He faces one now. Old Trafford lights up to mobile phone cameras can be seen all around the stadium as Messi delivers but over thrust his head back in slight disappointment there got some velocity in the shot but not dipping had it been on target I think Beto was at Liverpool but only speculation at the moment to space here for Di Maria the stretch here Portugal Higuain's offside flags already up Mike Malarkey had that flag raised very quickly and they had a two on one here just didn't hold his run Higuain it's a correct decision from Mike Malarkey the assistant but really Gaitan. Decent run this. Making inroads into that Portugal defence. Nicolas Gaitan. Here's Ansaldi. Di Maria! And that's lifted the atmosphere at Old Trafford. A shot on goal. Ansaldi with the setup here for Di Maria. Struck it well. Beto in the Portugal goal, always dealing with it. Mascherano, good run here from Gaitan. That's an excellent effort from Nicolas Gaitan. Lovely ball, this though, from Mascherano. Speared onto the head here of Gaitan, who was onside. Just coming on the blind side of the young fullback, Rafael Guerrero. Beto always hoping it would travel wide, and it did. Bruno Alves. Spears a terrific pass, pass of the night. Not a bad take either by Koresma. Into Ede! Well, that's so much better from Portugal. We've really been flat for most of the evening. What a pass! from Bruno Alves, wonderful take as well from Koresma. And Eder was sniffing his first senior international goal there. Silva, oh, it struck Eder, turns into a pass for Koresma. Free header! Portugal win it, and it's Rafael Guerrero! And a wry smile passes the lips. And the coach Fernando Santos and what a moment for the 20 year old Rafael Guerrero he bought a ticket for the raffle and wins his debut only last Friday against Armenia and the left back from Lorient in France stoops to conquer and Portugal surely have won it A thrilling moment for that young man. There's no time for the comeback. Rafael Guerrero, the toast of Portugal. Their first win over Argentina 
for 42 years. And it came in stoppage time. Only getting his opportunity because they're so short of left backs. But he's made quite an introduction. And this only his second senior cap tonight.